And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City against Atletico Madrid. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And providing the main goal scoring threat today is Erling Haaland. And here are the starters for Atletico. Jan Oblak gets the nod in goal. Thomas Lamar starts alongside Rodrigo de Paul in central midfield. And up front, Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Morata. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Morata and here's Lamar Carrasco and back with Griezmann well that's how to keep the opposition at bay well it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action he can be absolutely unstoppable and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one Stuart well, in many ways, he's a throwback to the 80s in the way he plays. He's so strong when holding up the play. He can outmuscle opponents. Today, the defenders will certainly know they've been in a battle. Oh, fancy footwork. OK, really might fancy this one, you know. Well, they seem to catch it on the wrong part of his head. with the ball confidently splendid tackle and a throw in coming up Manuel Akanji Foden Gundogan terrific block he'll be breathing a sigh of relief ball one Gundogan Holland Foden Tremendously strong in the tackle De Paul Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank Well, rule two have taken up an illegal position only just
Koke. Good work from City to win back the ball. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. The goal kick will be next. What about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? Really good interception. Oh, a nice looking pass. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. A City free kick forthcoming. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well, not the end result he had in mind. Well, we know he can hit them from that sort of range, but that was a poor effort in the end. Griezmann. Now with Morata. Okay. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Commitment to passing and attacking. Gundogan. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Tremendous challenge. Can he find the right pass? Body in the way. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while they're having this good period that you do sense it's coming. So a deflection and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. And De Bruyne firing it over. Not the best clearance. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Lamar. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Nicely cut out. Well, it could be on for him here. Can he finish? And in it goes! Manchester City strike first in the Champions League final. Well, here's the replay, and they get this just right, don't they? The timing of the pass is absolutely brilliant. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And take it away, he won the ball. The 
Rodrigo de Paul. Morata. Gundogan. De Bruyne. Gives it a go. And just narrowly wide in the end. Carrasco. Well, the ball back with City here. And into the last 30 minutes now. And he might be through here. Well, the chance looked to be on, but found himself offside. Manuel Akanji. It's with Gundogan. Very quick thinking there. Morata. Morata! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And a routine catch for the Brazilian. Well, he's lost the ball. Holland. De Bruyne. It's with Gundogan. Foden. Can he take the chance? Oh, a superb save. And here's a change now for Atletico. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not the greatest header, but astute defending. Koke. Correa. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, as we can see here, the pass from Griezmann is absolutely perfect. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. A very good tackle. Holland. Manchester City still on the attack as the minutes tick away. Can they come up with a winner? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. 
Well, that was easy on the eye, and he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace, just couldn't finish it off. Five minutes left. Firing it towards goal! But the keeper takes charge, and it was pretty straightforward. Lamar. And here they come now. Atletico looking for a late winner. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Correa. And here's Lamar. They could pick out a teammate. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. And they get so back in business here the first period of extra time and it might well come down to mental fortitude who wants this more De Paul excellent vision and a certain routine save He might be able to profit from the wide position. Correa. And now Lamar. Koke! What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. City couldn't keep the ball. Griezmann. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Defenders need to cover. No problems for the keeper. Now, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And intercepts again. Half-time in extra time, and still they are level. Oh, fancy footwork. And so, 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. De Bruyne. Mares. A spot on with that challenge. This might be ideal for the counter. They need to get bodies back. But really sticking to their task defensively. Well, the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. 
Oh, terrific pass. Oh, it's gone in for Manchester City. How about that? Near the end of this Champions League final. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And what a clinical finish this is. Hit with such power by Mares. Not much chance for the goalkeeper there. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Five minutes remaining in this, the second period of extra time. Holland. And he might be through here. It's opened up for him. A goal! And that is going to be that. Name of the trophy for certain. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but woeful defending. Underway again with the score at 3 1. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Really vital interception here. And there it is, full-time Manchester City Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players... Well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The Champions League victors, Manchester City. So please, sabar karai, sabar whatever. Please, sab, sab, uh, I want to reach one million likes. So please, Okay, thank you.